We are in Hong Day today. Uh, did no vlog yesterday because we are tired and did absolutely nothing. Um, I remember this area from last time we were here and I forgot how busy it is. Um, I remember I hate coming out of that station because it's so crowded initially but I think it's actually less busy than what it was last time probably because it's winter. But where are we going? A Nike store. We're going to a Nike store. Sally reckons everything's different. It looks pretty much the same to me. Except for the Christmas lights in almost March. We're just standing, this is all I can see. We're gonna have to re-watch it on the video so we can see what's happening. And of course we got distracted by an art box along the way to the Nike store. We found the shooting range. Here. Found the Nike store Sally wanted to go to. Apparently you can make your own thing here. You can embroider it on things. Oh, uh, the Nike store was a bust. I didn't have what I wanted. Now we're going to check out this MLB store that we saw. And a cafe here apparently. Also very underwhelming. It's more of like a fake fashion label store more so than a baseball store. Apparently someone's live streaming in here. Don't know why. It seems like um, MLB brand here is more of like a trend label more so than like a store where you buy like jerseys and that. Now we're in some sort of vintage store that smells like grape bubble gum. <laughs> Mm. Back on the main street again. Just in case you want a view of the city while you take a pee. We're just waiting to enter this vegan place called Plant in Hongdae. And this is our dinner. Misaka. Bunless mushroom burger. And chili cheese fries. All vegan. We're in Myeongdong this evening. Um, and we're trying to get to the Namsan cable car station to go up to see Ensel Tower. We're just trying to figure out where to go from the train station here. Sifui. That's what it looks like to me. From the station we took exit 3 and we just like took a left where the sign said. And it says we have to go right at the Pacific Hotel and actually you can see the tower there. So I assume we just walk towards that. I think that's what we're going on. It's really cramped in here. I don't like it. Oh, it rocks more than you think it's going to. And that's how we would have had to walk up. At the base of the tower is this cool gazebo thing. There's the tower. <laughs> this is a very popular spot to do these love padlock things. We're actually not going to pay to go up because it costs 16,001. Um, Keith's not interested and I've gone up multiple times. This is the way to the observation deck entrance via a gift shop it looks like. Let's see if we can go for free. Okay, it's not the observation deck, but there's a cafe sitting area. You get a decent view. And 
and this is the view from the main like observation area the free one oh my god this is a time capsule it's a time capsule they buried it in 1985 on the 17th of October and they're going to open it in 2485. That's a long time away. Not sure what's in it. That's cool. And if you cross the courtyard, this is the view you get. What do you think of the tower? Like a big tower you have to pay to go up and see this view of the river uh, it's cold but it's pretty cool up here um cable car is probably not worth it i would just walk it but it's cool we're gonna walk down yeah walking down would be cool do you want to get your fortune how much is it One thousand? I think it's a thousand. Okay, Keith's doing it. He's a horse. Did you smash it? Oh, well, maybe. I think you can just pop it open. Oh. But there's a hammer here. Let's smash it. Oh. Or because it's in lots of languages. Is there an English? Nope. Okay, we'll translate it. <laughs> what kind of... I think my fortune is forever going to be a mystery. No, I'm going to find out. Well, luck is good, but coveting other people's things will be useless. You can enjoy an abundance of leisure with your own. Do not covet other people's things and have vain thoughts. You need to have a mind to beat even stone bridges. Okay, now we're heading down. I don't know whether the stairs are the best way to go down, because there's another way also, but we'll see. This way looks pretty cool, because we're walking next to a wall. Wow. Look at this view. It keeps going. Successfully stopped my hands from freezing just for a little bit. The vlog's gonna be very intermittent as I take the camera out of my pocket while they warm up. We had to change the battery and it was quite painful because it's very cold up here. This is very steep. I'm now glad I didn't walk up it. I'm changing my mind. I think the cable car is worth it because <laughs> this is very steep and well, I think I'd rather come up than go down looks really cool though, even though I'm freezing. And there's the tower. We just walk down there. Let's keep going down. Just like part way up here, there's just this outdoor gym that even has like full on weights and everything. I've never seen an outdoor gym like this before. You know, just in case running up that mountain is not enough exercise for you. Trying a new experience here. It's going to be my first time riding a bus in Seoul. Okay. The next bus is Forage. That's the one we're taking. Here comes our bus. We're riding the bus. Okay, this is dangerous. Sally's navigating. We could end up anywhere. Well, she's leading me down this weird alleyway at the moment. 
I don't know. Do you think she has it? Well, she's at least led us to some civilization. It's better than that weird alleyway. So this is the hotel we're going to stay at, but we decided to pick our one. Um, I don't know what I prefer. I mean, I haven't stayed in this one. This area's got like a lot more going on immediately outside. It's a bit more touristy. Um, I quite like our area though. It's a little bit more quiet in certain spots. Yeah, we have to backtrack. Sally walked past where we had to go. Are you sure this is it? Over there's the back entrance. <laughs> Once again, this is the hotel we're going to stay at over here. We're back at the hotel again. We have to go around. Okay. I trust you. We have to go around. It's down the alleyway. It is, is down the creepy alleyway after all. How come everywhere we try to go to is closed? <sighs> Very loud. We waited like 45 minutes to get in here. Uh, we're at a barbecue place. Besides. So. If this area is looking familiar, it's because we're back in Songsu and we're trying to go back to Sunny Bread. It's 11. Got here just on time. We're gonna give Sunny Bread another go. Oh, okay, this is the second floor of Sunny Bread. We're up here by ourselves at the moment because we're the only ones here. This is really cool up here. Oh, hi. I think a table, even though this looks really cool. That's why I grabbed the camera. Did you vlog the food? I didn't vlog the food. I was so hungry that I just ate without vlogging. We're at Sunny Bakery now. I vlogged that part. I just didn't vlog the food. Yeah, I vlogged that part. I just vlogged everything but the food. Through the power of editing, we have photos of the food. This is going to be food. We had a delicious grilled eggplant sandwich and a coffee. It came with pickled jalapenos. Whoops. Hello! We are now in Kangdam. I don't really know where we are here. There's just lots of buildings. Um, we just got out one of the exits and we're just walking to see what there is here. That was sneaky of her. We we're just walking and then she just slipped into a Muji suddenly. This Muji actually has fresh food you can get. That looks really like good. Kimpups. It does look good. Like an avocado kimpup. They also sell hot baked sweet potatoes. There's also a kitchen over there. What's your favourite Muji ever? This Muji even has a bakery. Now we found a giant cacao friend store. They're kind of cool. This peach thing is creepy. Is the photo booth free? Go on for me. What do I do? <laughs> He's really bad. I don't want that. Okay. <laughs> there we go. We found how to set up our living room. Forget Muji. Apparently there's some sort of BTS Lego collab. I think this is the Lego. It's like the only one, right? We're in some really fancy e-mart and we got some snacks because we're a little bit hungry. It has like a sitting area. Kind of looks like these. Oh, oh, what are these? The potato stick things that I got? And we got... Have a good... Have a good... Pung. Bread. Pum. No. No, it's not pung. So it's not bread, my bad. Or room. So uh, this is like a soju brand pop-up. By pop-up, it's basically established building. I don't think it's a pop-up. There's these funny things out the front. And I guess we're joining the line to get in. We now have a 15 minute wait at this door. 
This is probably not worth it. So only like five minute wait. We're in now. Whoa. Okay. This is uh this is not what I expected. I'm not even blocking the goal. <laughs> I'm not even blocking it. Yay. These things are creepy. Despite this massive uh, soju place, you actually couldn't even buy or try soju in there at all. <laughs> and there was a photo booth. How long was the wait? An hour. An hour for a photo booth. People here are crazy. They love their photo booths. There we go. I've been a tourist. I've seen the Gangnam style area. Nobody's here anymore. I thought more people would be saying they're dancing. Okay, we're going into some bakery thing here. So... Apparently this place does rice breads, rice red bean bread. So this is the bread that they're famous for. It went up in price. Oh no, but it is all rice. How many do you want? Um, I want one right now. Yeah, I want one right now. Let's get six. A do half dozen. So if you look nice and closely, yeah, um, you can see the allergen info. At the top there, first one, meal, wheat. But at least they have it there for me. Somebody's hungry for bread. What about my bread? You want a bread? Yes, of course I want a bread. Read it. E song dong dang. Tang. E song dong. We've actually had this bread before when we we're in Gunsan in 1945. Um, it was really good there. I didn't know they had a place here also. It's like a red bean bread, but it's actually made from rice flour. So I can eat it. Also, the oldest bakery in Korea. Is it the same? It's better in Korea. I think we're currently under the Lotte World Tower is a Gordon Ramsay burger place apparently. I feel like I should look at the menu at that. Let's go look at the menu. Okay, where was I before I got distracted by the burgers? Um, we're under the... I assume it's above us, right? The Lotte World Tower? I don't know. We're in this area. It's very busy here though. This has probably actually been the busiest I've seen anywhere here. That's the giant building that we're under, the Lotte Tower. What is it, the fifth largest building in the world? It's pretty big. 